So when we talk about the importance of marketing, one of the key areas um, and reasons for having that, having a plan and some structure is making sure that we have consistency in the frequency of the activity. Now we know that business owners are super busy. So by having a plan in place um, and, a, and a, um, a timing plan in place, it allows and gives a better chance of the activity to happen and, and a high chance of success. Um, whether you're allocating a resource internally to do it or whether you're working with a consultancy like Little Marketing to help you implement it. Um, it's about being top of mind with your audience. Now the activity doesn't have to be, you have, don't have to over invest in the activity, but you just have to make sure that you are frequent and that you are top of mind. Um, customers and clients may not need to buy from you or need your product or service today, tomorrow or next week, but the time will come when they need to consider uh, what you offer. So if you've been top of mind, and there's a fine balance between top of mind and spamming the hell out of everybody, um, being top of mind with what you uh, do um, is always a, a good play. So for example, we had a client, or we still have a client, they import product from overseas. Beginning of COVID, um, they were having issues fulfilling orders. And so we, uh, the client said, look, we wanna, st we wanna stop some of the activity. And I said, do me a favor, don't stop the activity. When you get the inquiries, I know that you can't fulfill the orders, but I feel like your business and you personally have the personality to say to these prospective customers, look, um, there is a pandemic, um, everyone is in the same boat. Let me grab your details and when, as we get to the point where we can start to fulfill orders and the shipments arrive, I will contact contact you and you can then make payment and we can fulfill your order then. Um, if we had to stop the activity, I've no doubt, I know for certain that there were hundreds of potential clients that would have fallen by the wayside, would have gone to the competitor, competitor would have said um, the same thing, they would have you know, said, look, we'll try to fulfill the orders later. So um, I'm glad that client listened to Little Marketing, got the client's details, and when they were ready to fulfill the order, like the rest of the world, um, he was able to do so. So the lesson, stay top of mind, regardless of what's going out there, keep the activity frequent. And the best way to do that is have some structure to your activity. And the best way to do that is to create a marketing plan.